Good evening guys and welcome to tonight's video. I'm going to talk really quickly about fasted cardio and whether or not it's an effective fat burning tool. So, short answer, yes and no. Okay, so that's first off, uh, let's talk about what fasted cardio is. Is what it sounds, basically, it's doing cardio in a fasted state. So most people do it in the mornings, obviously because they haven't eaten all night. Okay? Now, some studies have shown that fasted cardio can mobilise fat. However, this is not the full story, okay? The important thing to think about uh, in terms of cardio and burning fat is it's not really what happens during the session, it's the response that your body has uh, to the workout throughout the course of the day, okay? It's a 24-hour thing. So it's the same as, same debate as steady-state cardio versus intervals. We want to effectively burn fat as much as we can throughout the whole of the day, okay? Now... Some of the problems with fasted cardio is, as you can imagine, your capacity to work decreases. Now, if you think you haven't eaten for, what, eight hours while you're asleep, maybe by the time you get to the gym, maybe nine hours, you're not going to have the same capacity to work as well as the mental tolerance of physical work, okay? So, also, fasted uh, cardio elevates cortisol. Now, cortisol... Um, is actually used, well, its primary purpose is to make stored energy available from fat, but also it happens to do the same form protein or muscle, okay? So what happens when cortisol is elevated is your body is almost in a catabolic state. It can almost sort of eat it itself, okay? Which can also make it, uh, you know, if you produce too much, uh, you risk losing muscle, risk, risk losing muscle mass, and also making it harder for you to build muscle mass in the future, okay? Now, we're gonna, I'm going to sort of round this up with a study, okay, that was uh, done in 2011 by a Paoli et al, I think you pronounce it. Uh, if anyone is interested, it's P-A-O-L-I. Um, they did a study, basically, um, to comparing fasted versus non-fasted cardio. So it was 36 minutes. And the fasted group actually used more fat during the session. Okay, however... The non-fasted group use significantly higher amounts of fat for 24 hours after the session. Okay, so sort of, I suppose the biggest question to come from this whole video is, do you want to burn more fat for 36 minutes a day or 24 hours a day? The choice is yours. In my opinion, I'd like to burn extra fat for 24 hours a day. So... That's my video for tonight. Nice and quick, nice and sharp. Hopefully you've got some value from that. If you did, please feel free to do the, uh, the usual like, comment and share. Always appreciate engagement on the posts. I was going to do a video tomorrow night, but I'm going to be out pretty much all day and all night. So it'll probably be Friday now. Um, so hopefully see you on that video and have a great evening. Thank you.